Hi there everyone, this is Mailman Zero playing Yoshi's Island. Today we've got the deceptively benign looking penguin. Danger, icy conditions ahead, just like in all of the previous levels in this area. This is an icy stage. Be careful, it's slippery and difficult to walk. Grab a red watermelon and you can breathe fire three times. Use it to melt ice or attack your enemies. This is the point in the game where we tell you about an item that's been there for a really long time that you've used a hundred times. And we tell you all about how ice works, even though you've already seen it and experienced its slipperiness many, many times. Hey look, spray water at me. Awesome. No, oh, I used some fire to melt that. Can I uh, use fire to melt that? Yes. But I don't have a brick. I need something. How else am I going to get this thing? I mean, it's obvious that I'm supposed to build a bridge. I'm just glad that I didn't mess it up. Like, I was supposed to do something before I built the bridge. Like how it usually works. Let's see if we can get this guy in here. Time it. Nope. Get a little closer. Nope, one more try. We can do this. Alright. Give me stars. Lots and lots of stars. Spray water for no reason. An enemy trapped in ice that I will not free. That guy wants to kill me. There are not a lot of opportunities for me to get ammunition. There is some ammunition. And this guy will eat the ammunition. And he will die. And there is another one. And I can't do anything because I don't have more ammunition, so I will just go around him. Wait, I have tons of eggs! Why do I keep thinking I have no ammunition? That's just foolishness. Ride the bucket in the icy water. The hand-drawn water. That was close. Let's see if there are any red coins here. Looks like two at the top. Alright. Another enemy in the ice. Just there for decoration, I guess. That's it, and that's all. Um, I've got fire. You want to get out of my way so I can start using my fire? Because uh, I got fire. Oh, I don't like these tiny ones. It feels harder, or it looks harder, but it's not. It's actually a little bit easier. Like, oh, wow. Is that good timing or what? So it says that I can breathe fire three times. And right there I breathe fire four times. Unless I can't count, which is possible. I'm full of eggs, which that means I'll need eggs. And if I had fire right here, I could get a midpoint. Will this give me fire? Probably not. Or yes, it will, of course. Midpoint! Let's see what else we can do. Oh! We've got a Mario run here. Super Mario! Just don't die. Already? He's done? Okay. I never noticed before that Yoshi just randomly is like there when Mario just- when Mario stops being able to run on his own. Which only can happen, of course, when he has a star or something. Yeah, these guys are... nerve-wracking. I, I must have missed something useful there. Should I go in here? Probably. Otherwise, why would there be a big place there to go? Wait, does that mean that I missed something by going here, or that I will get something special by going here? Well, I got a 1-up, that's special. Of course, the 1-up, I think, was just because I had 100 coins, but... Aside from that fact, it looks like they've transported us to a previous level. At least the gimmick is from the previous level. You know, there's snow on these, but they're not slippery. I guess snow is not slippery, but ice is slippery, which is kind of true. Not completely true, but it fits. Oh boy. 
Can I hit these guys with uh, this thing? Oh, good. So, so far, I've been just landing on a lot of these guys' heads, hoping that that kind of takes the wind out of the ice sails. Because if they touch me once... Oh, speaking of once and I'm dead! Oh, no! I guess I could have jumped. I think that would have helped, but... Wow. Way back here, huh? So this is what we're doing. I guess I want to do that Mario run again, so I'll get this fire. Oh, I see. The Mario run continues if I do it correctly. But not if I don't. Oh, and I can only do this if I've got the Mario. And this is probably something really good that I can only get if I keep getting the Mario stuff. So, dying wasn't the worst thing that could have happened before. Because by really good, of course, I mean it was just that. But now I come up here, and of course I come out in the same place I would have, but I don't. I actually get a chance to do a completely new area with Mr. Helicopter. Some of these levels have a lot of hidden stuff in them. This is just... there's absolutely no incentive for me to really go down there. Oh no, I gotta get more points. But not keep hitting those guys, because... Yeah, come on. Not bad. I mean, seriously, I got, like, 200 coins. Well, I at least got two one-ups while I was here. Not too bad. And now it puts me back to where we were before. So I don't get to skip anything here, I just, um, I just got an extra bonus area. Which, hey, I'm not gonna complain about a bonus area. Oh, I thought that that guy would give me some extra bounces if I landed on his head. And now all of my places have despawned, and now I'm dead because I bounced into the side of him. What a waste! That's beautiful. I lost the connection with a keyboard in the other room, right in the middle of my video, which is what I was hoping would happen. Okay. One more time. See, this is kind of interesting. I die if I'm in here and probably collect enough coins that I can get a couple of coins. So I'm actually having enough wind by coming back here getting as many coins as possible. Yeah, that's too bad. That's too bad. That's what I want. She can't be bad, so I cannot get more coins. But yeah, that's pretty good. And like somehow they get up to that again and keep going, but nope. I'll see if I can complete this area without dying. Because, you know, it's kind of a play game, so the area is without dying. Because you can't complete them if you do die. I think the levels need to have more places, right? Farm for blocks. That's just your requirement. What? Why didn't that do anything to them? Why is this switching? Oh, uh, what's going on? Oh, this part. Okay, I don't know where the guy went, but we gotta clear these out of the way as soon as possible. And maybe I can do some, some angles to do that. Some puzzle bobble action. Okay, we did that. Now we should be able to get these back. You know, I'm going to pause and see if I can fix this uh, slowdown issue. Okay, I think I might have solved it. If not, I'll have to just finish the level anyway. Yeah, I'm still hearing it. We'll see what happens here. Oh, this is bad. Wait, wait, what just happened? I got skis! So there are skis somewhere in this game. 
But now that I have skis, I have to be very careful with my jumps that I don't end up landing in a pit. Oh, oh, and into the pit I go. Oh good, there was a middle ring right before here. Now I'm skied up. Mario has his little Mario hat on, but it's all skied up looking, like uh, Santa Claus or something. This is, this is, uh, yeah. Now, this, this is definitely reminding me of um, maybe a minecart run. So if I jump at the right time, then I get good stuff. If I don't, then I miss things. I'm, I'm, whoa, I'm really trying to pay attention here. Whoa, what just... Oh, man. Been here before. I think I hit a tiny rock or something last time. That if you don't know what's there, is almost impossible to miss. I mean, really. This is like kind of like, well, not quite as bad, but this is like the Battletoads level too. Oh, happiness, the goal. Oh, yes, of course. Let's get some one-ups to make up for uh, our failure there. Eighty-five, not too bad. Come on. We can get some one-ups here. One-up chance? It's roulette? Oh. So I've got to gamble some Yoshis. So. Okay, I think that's fair. As long as I don't get a times zero, then we'll be good here. Okay. And then... Plus zero. So I end up with the exact same number that I started with. Well, you win some, you lose some, and then sometimes nothing happens. Join me next time. Bye.